adrenal gland. They are a pair of yellowish, flat, pyramid-like glands, which lie over the upper end of the kidneys. They look like a cap on the kidney. Each gland has an outer yellow adrenal cortex, an inner reddish brown adrenal medulla. Adrenal medulla secretes two hormones called adrenaline or epinephrine and non-adrenaline or non-epinephrine. These are commonly called catecholamines. In conditions of physical and mental stress such as fall in blood sugar levels or when a person is injured or exposed to cold conditions or suffering with pain. It is also secreted during anger, fear or grief. It helps the body to face these conditions. It is therefore called fight, fright and flight. These hormones increase alertness, pupillary dilation, raising of hairs, sweating, etc. The hormone increases blood supply to heart and skeletal muscles. It constricts arterioles and blood supply to skin and gastrointestinal tract. The bronchioles dilate. There is increased rate of breathing, oxygenation and heartbeat to meet any emergency. Catecholamines stimulate the breakdown of glycogen resulting in increased concentration of glucose in blood. They also stimulate the breakdown of lipids and proteins. Adrenal cortex can be divided into three layers called zona reticularis, inner layer, zona fasciculata, middle layer, zona glomerulosa, outer layer, Adrenal cortex secretes many hormones called corticoids. A. Glucocorticoids involved in carbohydrate metabolism, example, cortisol. B. Mineralocorticoids. Corticoids which regulate the balance of water and electrolytes in our body, example, Aldosterone. Glucocorticoids stimulate gluconeogenesis, lipolysis, and proteolysis and inhibit cellular uptake and utilization of amino acids. Cortisol is also involved in maintaining the cardiovascular system and kidney functions. It also produces anti inflammatory reactions and suppresses the immune response. Cortisol stimulates RBC production. Aldosterone acts at renal tubules and stimulates reabsorption of Na plus and water excretion of K plus and PO4 minus. Thus, aldosterone helps in the maintenance of electrolytes, body fluid volume, osmotic pressure and BP. Small amount of androgenic steroids are also secreted by adrenal cortex, which play a role in the growth of axial hair, pubic hair, and facial hair during puberty.